The following video demonstrates the technique used during arthroscopy to better localize an osteochondral defect of the knee. This particular technique is demonstrated here during a case involving a 12-year-old boy with an OCD lesion involving the lateral aspect of his medial femoral condyle. Because of continued symptoms after activity restrictions such as pain, swelling, and catching, the decision was made to pursue arthroscopic fixation of his OCD lesion. This view of the medial femoral condyle is obtained via an anterolateral knee portal with the knee flexed to approximately 90 degrees. A dionyx blunt trocar is inserted through an anteromedial portal. The trocar is used to palpate the surface cartilage overlying the osteochondral defect as it corresponds to the area depicted on the MRI. As you can see, the blunted tip has less small impressions or dimples in the cartilage of the weight-bearing portion of the medial femoral condyle. When this same amount of pressure is applied to areas of cartilage not overlying the lesion, a dimpling effect could not be visualized. The dimples upon a white background resemble those of a golf ball, hence the moniker the golf ball sign. These impressions will later serve as a guide for definitive fixation of the defect.